The New Orleans Arena, home of the New Orleans Hornets, could soon become the Louisiana Seafood Arena if the Louisiana Seafood Promotion Board secures the naming rights to the state-owned facility. As This Week in Louisiana Agriculture's A.J. Sabine shows us, the board's prospective plan could be a slam dunk for an industry trying to recover after the 2010 British Petroleum oil spill. The home of the New Orleans Hornets could be getting a little more flavor if the Louisiana Seafood Promotion and Marketing Board acquires the naming rights of the New Orleans Arena. The money to buy the naming rights will come from a portion of the $30 million the board received from BP after the Deepwater Horizon oil spill. Board Executive Director Yule Smith says securing the naming rights is an unconventional way to set the Louisiana seafood brand apart. Billboards, radio, TV, all the different traditional media, we can work with that. But what is non-traditional? And the Hornets Arena gives us a platform like no other platform. There's 30 to 32 of these crown jewels around the, around the United States. It gives us a platform to ele elevate the brand of Louisiana seafood like never before. According to agreements with BP, the Seafood Board can only spend oil spill money for the promotion and marketing of Louisiana seafood within the next three years. However, Smith says the Seafood Board will not likely spend all of its BP money on the naming rights deal. The Louisiana Seafood Board is going to look for the biggest way, the best way we can spend this fu these funds. And we're, the, the, the offer that the Hornets are bringing to the table Will, pro will provide over two billion impressions. What other forms of advertising can bring us two billion impressions? How much would we have to spend in traditional media to get to two billion impressions? Mm -hmm. Would we have to spend 15 or 20 million dollars? Uh, the deal, we're still working at the deal, the price with the Hornets, that's yet to be determined, but it's a very, very fair price that works, that may work for us. The Louisiana Seafood Promotion and Marketing Board is already a sponsor of the New Orleans Hornets, but it may take on a partner like Zatarans if it decides to ink a long-term naming rights deal. Moving forward, a decision from the Seafood Board to acquire the naming rights could take as long as 90 days. Smith says if the deal goes through, the brand of Louisiana seafood could be on par with FedEx and Staples. It's not just benefiting Louisiana seafood, it's benefiting the state of Louisiana, it's benefiting the hospitality industry, it's also benefiting the restaurant industry. All these industries can tap into the messaging that we use to promote our state and our culture and our heritage. And the Hornets have been incredible partners so far. For This Week in Louisiana Agriculture, I'm A.J. Sabine. The Louisiana Seafood Marketing and Promotion Board comes under the jurisdiction of the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries and receives state funding.